Could you repeat the question, please? Yeah, uh, a couple of weeks ago when Arjun decided to uh, get everyone together for this, he was being very ambitious and, uh, and I was wondering what he was up to because through the years I've always had great faith in Arjun being, you know, somebody who always does a first in things and I'm not disappointed at all. When I showed up for fittings, he put these beautiful clothes on me and uh, immediately I wanted to know the history of the garments because he always finds his inspiration in global reality, you know, and, and the, the beauty of natural fabrics from anywhere in the world. And this time he's inspired by the textures, the material, and the patterns of Northern Thailand, particularly the Yao tribe. And I support something like that completely because I happen to have actually seen, you know, the, the outfits, the kind of clothes, the kind of material that they wear over there. And Arjun has taken that and fused it with uh, Indian Arjunness, a royal, a royal feel. And I think he's done it beautifully. He's always been my favorite designer. I back him up every time he asks me to. So it's great. What's about your look and your white, white? Even you made a stunning entry Oh, you think so? <laughs> Thank you. Tell us about your look. The look, the look is uh, something which Arjun thought might look nice on me, and uh, so we did it. I'm his canvas. You know what I mean? Are you happy? Are you happy? <laughs> yes, very much so. Very much so. I love the clothes. I feel comfortable. I mean, I love the pants. They're you know, the fold up and tie up and then fold over again. They're very comfortable and I feel like I'm in pajamas, loafing around my house, yet I feel like I'm a king in a palace. <laughs> what do you have to say? What do you think? Har din utke ye karu ke. Yeah, I like the look, but I think it'll be painful to keep doing it. Uh, I think once in a while to do something different is also fun, no? <laughs> Well, very dramatic at the same time the mood had to be very distinctly well you see if you if you if you were listening to the music it was all drum beats and uh, you know we had to find our own rhythm to it so the key is to get into the psyche of the designer who wants us to be very extroverted very out there very uh, in communicating with the audience, you know, literally, like making contact with strangers and just making everybody feel so comfortable. So if you can understand that, then I think today the models did a great job in doing it. I don't think so. But we need showstoppers and we No, that's just a trend, you know, I mean, you don't need it. I don't, I mean, I don't, I'm not here representing Bollywood, if you, if you think, I mean, I, there's nothing Bollywood about me at the moment, if you look at me. I'm just another model walking the ramp for a designer that I believe in and just, you know, every, each model looks stunning in their own way, you know, and different. The fact that somebody may be from a different industry, I feel should not influence the thing, even though out of recognition people do, you know, so it's something you can't change, but it doesn't influence it. Really. Yeah. Really, it's over. Your show was fantastic. Come and sit. Thank you so much. Thanks. Are you expecting somebody else? Yeah, there, I think three other boys. I don't know where they are. Come closer, dude. One second. We're expecting more people. This is our moment. This is our moment. Thank <laughs> you. My everyone's positive response. Man. Unbelievable. Now I'm gonna party. This is better. Than, this is a, this is suave. No man. No no that's drama. The way, that's the way, man. Buddy, where you guys, man? Starji are going. Sorry. No no no. Ab utho ke tali baare. Starji. Where all these stars, man? We're getting all the stars. Don't worry. <laughs> Here's another star. Ladies and gentlemen, Kelly Dorji, come this way. Who's left here? Oh. <laughs> Sorry? Is that it? I think we're missing Upen. Upen is still to come. He's always late. Why is Upen? See. I'll be really brief. I mean, that's the expression I think I, I portrayed it on the ramp. Um, the inspiration was north of Thailand. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a hill tribe called the Yao people. Um, it's the Golden Crescent, which is the Golden Triangle. 
which exists of north of Thailand, Laos and Burma. That in essence is the look of the collection. Uh, but I think the palette was completed with my budding stars who are sitting left and right of me. And I think uh, they completed that canvas for me. Uh, and I've always strongly believed that an artist can't be, um, he's not complete without his, without his brush, his paints, and that canvas. And to me, that's my canvas. Actually speechless. And I couldn't have wished for a better audience as well. I believe I had a standing ovation. Yes, all the way. Trust me, it's the most beautiful you were moment in my life. For him. That was, that's what matters, <laughs> all the way. Thank you. Thank you. For you, Farouk. <laughs> Two there. <laughs>